if you like to get out and enjoy Portland, this is frightening. Portland police trying to piece together a shooting during the last Thursday event in Northeast Portland last night. It left three people injured. Yeah, the most disturbing part, it seems as though the suspect had no regard for anyone's safety, opening fire at a crowded event with hundreds of people around. Reporter Brent Weisberg joins us now from a much quieter Northeast Alberta neighborhood this morning with more on what happened. Brent? Ken and Jenny, good morning. Portland police say that this was their biggest fear, that someone would start opening fire in a crowded place. This is where that shooting happened last night in one of the busiest and most popular places in Northeast Portland. Last night, police say there were about 300 people right here on the streets of Northeast Alberta enjoying ice cream, pizza, and having drinks with friends and family when all of a sudden bullets started to fly. Witnesses call it one of the most chaotic scenes that they have ever been at. Police call it one of the most brazen acts of gang violence that they have seen. The shooter, a 16-year-old boy now in custody, expected to be charged later this afternoon. Our cameras were there as he was arrested by police. Police say that two 15-year-old boys were shot. A third victim, a 25-year-old woman, all expected to survive. The shooting happened right as police were around the corner patrolling the last Thursday event, which brings people into northeast Portland from Beaverton, Vancouver, and other parts of town. It's a little scary that summer's just starting and it's um, too close to home. Very concerning that someone would be so bold to shoot into a crowd of people. And police say that because there are so many witnesses out here that many of those people were able to point out the suspect as he ran again, 16 years old. That is how old police say that this suspect is. They do confirm that they have recovered a handgun that they believe was used in the crime. They did some testing to confirm that. That 16-year-old boy expected to be in court later today. Portland police also asking Ken and Jenny that if anyone has video of the shooting itself or the moments right after to contact detectives, we have their phone number online at uh, coin.com right now. All right. Thanks, Brent. Very upsetting. Uh, that's